the first half was out of this world. All I can say is I did a heck of a job at halftime with my speech to you. But, you know, I, I, think, I think probably, it's, you know, it may be good for us to, 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 to see the difference between being intense and being, doing things right, making things happen on defense, in the same way offensively. Just it don't, you know, football is, so, is such a, a game where inches mean so much. But that inch may be in desire. It's not necessarily on the field in, 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 uh, in, in yards and feet out there to make first downs. It may be down inside your heart. What you want, how bad did you want to keep Georgia Tech out of the end zone the second half? We've had some, we've had to come over some adversity this year. You know, we lost Bo Jackson earlier in the season. Then we lost Steve Wallace, you know, our big, big left tackle, last week. And now, you know, a Pat comes up with a, with a hamstring injury. So you figure you lose a, a, one of your best running backs and, you know, your starting left tackle, and then you lose your starting quarterback. You know, the team's either got to, you know, come together or either it's going to fold. And we came together today. I, I think uh, I just... You know, it's, it's a very exciting feeling for me. And then they come back and they run the corner route, and Clayton was coming in. And he said, "I'll be there." Throw it. And I threw it, and he was there. I told you know, I told Jeff to just like put it out there anyway, and I was gonna try to run a good route. And I knew if I could like get the defender off just a little bit, and the ball was out there, I could go get it. And that's exactly what happened. He put it out there, and uh, nice to know you got three quarterbacks you can count on, right? Yeah. You know, at the first of the year when um. When, that, when people were talking about who was going to be the quarterback, they just, you know, I think a bunch of people, a lot of people on the team said that, you know, we could play either one and, uh, you know, and win with them because they're all just they're all just great quarterbacks. And uh, that showed that today, you know, we could play any quarterback and win with them. They all have great arms and, uh, you know, great great ability. Coach Boda had told me that Coach Dow was real impressed with my catching in the last couple of weeks of practice. And um, he said my time was coming, and it did. So <laughs> it makes you feel good, huh? It feels real good, real good. When Bo, when we found out Bo wasn't going to be here, we all pull together. You know, with Pat, you know, it doesn't matter who's in there as long as we're doing what we're supposed to do in the winter. Well, um, came from the offensive line. They just made a whole building off a, a transport truck to drive through. And uh, I just ran. And just hate to say it, but it was just a couple of them. I just had to run over, you know, just to get in the end zone. And I used my power to run over and get in the end zone. You, uh, is this going to be a habit scoring every week? It's kind of nice, isn't it? <laughs> I, don't, I would like for it to be a habit, you know. You hadn't scored since Mississippi State two years ago. Did it feel good? <laughs> it felt pretty good. Now you got to go to Mississippi State next week. Yeah, I hope to, hope to get another one there, uh, too. First interception. Great. Feel good? Feels great. You just stepped in front of the guy. Yeah, he kind of threw it behind him. And, you know, I just, he just hit me in the chest. I'm, I should have run a touchdown. <laughs> Fell to my knee. Well, we were just so far ahead. Coming out, you know, we just had a mental letdown in the second half, and I guess you could expect that after we had done so well in the first half. But I feel like we learned something from this win. We were just going to stay with our plan that we used the first half, which we did, and uh, they came out the second half and they were fired up. Uh, we were fired up, but we weren't really the way we were in the first half, and uh, they just executed.
Bremer. Thank <laughs> you. 